why is it happening right in the middle of my bubble bath? It's a tornado siren. Quick, turn on the news. An F5 tornado is cutting its way through the city, and it could be headed for the kitchen. With more, we go to Pineapple in the field. Thanks, Tom. I'm not really sure I should be out here. Ow! But I guess this is what wins Emmys. What do you see, Pineapple? What's going on? Well, the tornado is super huge. It's changing course at random and... Oh, it appears to be heading toward... Oh. My. Pineapple, what is it? It just took out a knife factory, Tom! Oh, this is bad. I gotta get out of here! Stay strong, Pineapple. We need you covering this tornado. This is no tornado, Tom. It's picked up hundreds, possibly thousands of knives from factories just wrecked. We're dealing with a full-blown... Knife! And now, uh, we go to Byron with sports. Uh, thanks, Tom. The Cleveland Browns, like, suck. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. You heard him. That knife needle could be here any minute. What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Everyone relax. We have a tornado seller for this exact type of situation. Whoa, really? Whew, that's a relief. You sound surprised, Orange. Sure am. I thought there was no way we'd have the foresight to make a tornado cellar. I figured we'd blow it for sure. <laughs> Orange, last year we tasked you with building the cellar. Um, what? You didn't build the tornado shelter? Where did all the money we gave you go? Um, definitely not towards these sweet kicks and chains. You don't have feet or a neck. Guys, I hate to break this up, but...
almost the third time we've almost died this week. One more and I get a free smoothie. Sorry, just the storm and everything. I was thinking about my dad. You can't bring him back, Helen, no matter how many storms you chase. That's not what it's about, Bill. It's about getting to the cause of these twisters, so no more baby carrots have to see their dad sucked away. Look, these storms seem pretty random, but I think this last one established a pattern. See? Would you please stop randomly spitting seeds? Okay! I didn't think that would actually work. Hey! You said to stop spitting randomly, so I did. Now I'm aiming them. See? Oh, hey, Orange, would you cut the shenanigans? You're messing with my workout. Fine! Yeah! And can you turn off the blender too? It's freaking me out! But I didn't spit any seeds at the blender. Oh, really? Then who did? Seriously, it wasn't me, I swear! Uh, okay. Uh, that's starting to freak me out, too. Don't worry. I got this. Uh -oh. This is where the next twister should be. Help me with the probes. Hey, what are you guys doing? We're storm chasers. We think there's about to be a tornado in here. What? Inside? Here? Yes. We don't really know what's causing them, but your kitchen is definitely next. Our probes here should tell us why. Hey, we make it through storm number four tonight, and I get that free smoothie. Smoothie? A oh, smoothie, of course. The tornadoes are being caused by malfunctioning blenders. Well, I have been on the fritz lately. Just started on its own all of a sudden. Squash, can you unplug it? <laughs> oh no, it's battery power. <laughs> Underground, we should be pretty safe in here. The probes are booted up. If the twister picks them up, we should have a full readout on it. More data than anyone's ever had before. That's it, we've got it. I can finally analyze an entire twister. Uh, hey, does it seem a little warm to anybody? My bed, body temperature's still up from my workout. Ah, oh, crap, the oven's on. Well, if I'm gonna get baked, at least I'm getting baked with my friends. I am not getting baked. Let's go. Well, you can't go outside either. Maybe we can ride the storm out before we broil. Doesn't look like it. Computer predicts this one could last a whole hour. We'll be charred crisp by then. Wait, yes, that's it. Maybe we can jam the blender's blades and stop them from spinning. With what? They're built to slice and dice. Game over, man, game over. The probes, they're metal. If we can shoot enough down the cyclone, that should jam the blades. But who can aim them? <laughs> Anyone else got a case of cotton mouth? It's like an oven in here. Well, you just volunteered yourself, Orange. <laughs> Remember, spit as many of those probes down as you can. You only have a few seconds before the cyclone sucks you down into those blades, too. So be quick. Sounds like a challenge. They don't call me the spitting citrus for nothing. <laughs> Do we do the right thing? No, but it is quieter now. Oh! Wow! You did it, Orange! Now we know how to stop the tornadoes! Hey, where's my truck? I just wish my dad could see what we've done. He'd be so proud. <laughs> Daddy? <laughs> I thought I'd never get down from there. Those twisters kept me spinning in the air for 20 years. But I knew you'd get me down, baby. A family reunion. It's so sweet. I, I must have something in my eye. Ah, that's nice. Agreed. They really know how to put the care in carrot, don't they? <laughs> Orange and pear, Orange and pear, best friends forever and they share underwear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, none of that is true. <laughs> Welcome back, Fruit.
Rudy Toots, underwear sharing BFFs, Orange and Pear here with another episode of How To. Uh, this week, Nyan Sheep wants to know how to survive a tornado. Great question, Nyan Sheep, and an equally great screen name if I do say so myself. <laughs> Please don't do the song. Moving on. Okay, step one. Listen for tornado sirens. That's right. If tornadoes are common in your area, your town probably has tornado sirens that sound like this. Uh, orange, orange, please, please stop. That doesn't even sound like a tornado siren. Uh, sorry, sorry, let me try again. <laughs> uh -uh, no, I meant no, as in please stop. Tell me my tornado siren sounds are accurate. No. Okay, 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 fine. Very, very accurate. Dang. <laughs> yeah. oh. Step two, when the tornado arrives, make sure you've made your way into the storm cellar. That's right. A storm cellar can protect you from the violent weather while you and your loved ones remain safe and sound underground. <laughs> safe and sound underground. That rhymes. Very good, Orange. Here's a gold star. Thank you. And for you, a TNT star. <laughs> Get that away from me! <laughs> Step three. Once a tornado has passed, come out of the storm cellar and help others who might need it. That's right! A lot of people might need help with their homework after the tornado blew their textbooks away. Well, that, that's not exactly what I meant. People also might need help with their hair after the tornado messed up their sweet dew. Orange, could you please just stay on topic for once? I'm sorry. I apologize. Thank you. Now, can we- I got you a gift. Because I'm sorry, Bear. All right. But if it's a stick of TNT, I swear. It's not a stick of TNT. I promise. You promise? Yes. I wouldn't give you a stick of TNT, Bear. All right. Yeah. My underwear sharing BFF deserves a TNT star. Ah! <laughs>